Hi guys, welcome back and today I'm outside because I'm going to show you how to change the color of a car by throwing a water balloon at it, just like this. And we are doing it in Final Cut Pro. For this effect to work, you're going to need three things. Number one, you're going to need a tripod so when you play the footage, it's not going to be shaky. And number two, obviously you need water balloons. And when you're throwing the balloons, you cannot be in front of the car. You cannot cover it. So basically, there has to be a space between you and the car at all times. Now I'm going to jump into Final Cut Pro and show you how to edit this. Just quickly, today's shout-out goes to Aiden NBA. I think today is your birthday or yesterday, but either way, happy birthday and shout-out to you. Of course, we're in Final Cut Pro right now. There's a long part, but I made it shorter, so this is the only part where it's smashing the car. So we're going to put it on the timeline. And now I, what you want to do is duplicate this clip. So basically, click Command-C on Mac, and then, then Command-V. And now put this clip on top of the other one. Obviously, I remove the audio from one of the clips. It does not matter which one. Now you can zoom into the timeline and then scroll until you hit the water balloon on the car but in this case I accidentally put it on the window. And in the moment of contact you just highlight the clip and click command B. Now we have the moment before and after when the balloon touches the car. Now we're gonna add a mask. You can also zoom in to draw a better mask so increase the view to at least 200%. Now I'm mask add all of the parts of the car that don't need to be colored. I'm talking about windows, wheels, and etc. Additionally, you have to put a separate mask on those elements. This is a little bit of a long process but the effect is gonna be cool. And then of course you have to draw the main mask around the car. So only the car is gonna be colored. Now that we have all the mask around the car, now we're just going to colorize it. So go to the right, click video effects, and then click colorize. Make sure to mark it correctly, sometimes we're going to have to click invert mask. You see, now the car is pretty much orange. Additionally, I put the blend mode as overlay, because it kind of looks the most realistic. And the best part about it is, since you already did the mask for the first color, you don't have to do it for the second color. Now for the second balloon, let's say this pink balloon, look for the moment that it hits. Then of course you split the clip at this very moment. And now all you need to do is change the color to pink. You see guys, you know orange and then pink. And now let's say the blue balloon. I accidentally threw it and it just like splashed on the ground. So make sure to hit the car. Also make sure the car is yours before you smash the balloons. Then same thing, got it? And all we need to do is mark the third balloon clip, adjust the color to blue. And now I'm going to play the full clip. Yeah! And this is how you can change the color of the car by smashing balloons. I hope you enjoyed, and if you want to learn more about Final Cut Pro, make sure to click this playlist. Make sure to subscribe because I post videos like these every single week. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys!